I want to do here is give you guys a demo of what the Pro Bell looks like. This is the handle. It'll have each one will have a little one of the FBBC dumbbell logos stamped into the end. And with it, you'll also need bolts. These particular ones are 10 inches long. Depending on the weight of the bell you're looking for, you'll get different size bolts. And now I'll show you putting together a bell. Here we got a Thomas Inch dumbbell, pro dumbbell handle, same diameter, same length. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and build a 172 pound pro dumbbell. So what I'll do is I grab the pro bell, stack up all the plates I intend to use on a scale. So in this combination I've already figured out gets us to 172. I'm pretty dead on. You're going to find you're going to play with plates and your combinations. You know, if you've got some heavy plates, some light plates, you'll find what you want to get to you. So, what you'll do is you'll select your plates, stack them up, get the overall height. In this case, I'm at 17 inches, 8.5. That selects up to 10 inch bolts. So, the other trick I'll show is your inside plate you want it to be these little one and a quarters I find preferably these smooth pancakes gives you something nice to rest your hand against okay put this guy together Grab the wrenches. Good. Now the last step is you're going to keep tightening it. And what you want to do is you want to get it really tight, almost like reefed on. So once you get it, there you go. Once you get it there, that's, that's tight, that's snug. Then you want to give it some juice. There you go. Now it's a single solid piece. It'll rotate. I probably won't even budget. Nope. There you have it.
172 pound Pro Bell. Now the next thing I want to show you is uh, how to dismantle them. If you do it right, you get them good and tight. They're pretty hard to take apart. So if you hold it here and try to pull, all you're gonna do is rotate it out. You're not gonna be able to get a good hold on everything. So if you got impact tools, this will work even better. If you do not, all you have is a pair of wrenches. Set your one wrench, grab your other wrench, and impact it off. Once you got it loose, you can pull things around, and take, change your weights. There you go.